Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Hi, great two. How are you today, great student? Inshallah, we will talk about the weather in the hot and the dry countries. But before this, let's revise on the last lessons. Okay, here we go. We live where? We live in the Middle East part of the earth. And the countries in the Middle East are hot and dry. Okay, so there aren't many different types of plants and animals in the Middle East. Here we have these examples in the hot and the dry countries. Camel, goat, lizard, snake, butterfly, locust, gerbil, moth, finch, date palm tree, olive tree, desert rose, French tamarisk, and panernav flower. Where do you love to live? You choose this because the weather here is good, not hot, not cold, but here is very hot. There is water here, there is no water here, and there is shadow here, there is no shadow here. And you know that living things are animals or plants. Adaptation means what? The things that animals or plants do, why? To stay alive. Like the plant adaptation here in hot and dry countries. Plants that adapted to hot and dry weather have what have thick leaves. The leaves are big from inside. Why? To keep cool and stop escaping of water. Stop water escaping. Stop water coming out of the plant so the plants stay alive. And here we have some animals adaptation. So here animals and the plants that live in hot and dry countries live by keeping cool and saving water. Elephant and the camel has what on the outer layer? How has have what thick skin? Thick skin to protect themselves from the sun. And here we have lizard, gerbil, and the snake. They protect themselves from the sun. How how by hiding in burrows? Hide in burrow holes in the sand or hide under rocks. Here we have bat or moth. They only come out at night. After that, we talk about environment, and environment means what? The land and the climate where plants and animals live. Climate means what? Weather, like hot, cold, dry, warm. So, if there is more water in any environment, in any place, so there will be more plants and animals. Excellent. Here we have three environments. This is what? Sea desert and mountains and after that we talked about two environments this is called what coastal fog woodlands and this one warm sea what are the animals that live in the coastal fog woodlands they are what leopard oryx warbler wolf and the animals that live in warm sea they are what whale turtle and tuna after that, we talk about these two environments. This is called what? Grasslands and mountains and this one, wetlands. What are the animals or plants that live in grasslands and mountains? Tell me. Here we have goat, sheep, and we have grass as plant. We have mountain, gazelle, and, and here we have vulture. They live in the grasslands and the mountains but in wetlands we have water so what are the animals or plants that be found in the wetlands we have what toot grass heron reeds and fish after that we talked about the desert environment desert environment what are the animals that live here they are gerbil snake camel and scorpion okay after this lessons we talked about the pollution pollution means what the bad things that happen to our environment bad things happen to our environment to the place that we where we live and kill what kill plants animals and pollutes water and air you remember this what are the types of pollution this is called what rubbish Letter smog. Can you hear? See here the smoke, the body smokes here. So here this is called what smog. Noise, noise, traffic pollution, traffic, 
pollution. Yesterday we talked about how can we stop the pollution, how can we help the environment to be clean, to be clean for us, for our health. So here, number one, don't litter, don't litter, don't throw the basket in the streets and to put the rubbish in its place. So don't litter and to put rubbish in its place. Number two, recycle bottles or anything. You can recycle it, recycle it. Recycle means what? Use the things again. Number three, don't play loud music. Don't noise other people. So don't play loud music. Today, inshallah, we'll talk about the weather in hot and dry countries. But before this, let's revise on something that you know from grade 1 and KG. You know the four seasons of the year. You know the four seasons. They are what? This is what? Spring season. Spring season. And here we have what? Summer season. Summer season. And here, fall season season fall season and the last one is winter season winter season you remember the four seasons of the year so what are the types of the weather here can you see this girl the weather here is what hot hot and here cold cold weather hot weather cold weather where is it? Hot weather and cold weather. Okay. These two girls. Can you see this girl? This girl is wet. Wet. Wet weather. The weather here is wet. Wet means what? Rainy. Wet means what? Rainy. And here we have dry. Dry, dry weather. Dry means what? Sunny. Sunny. So we can write what here? Dry. Sunny dry sunny and here we have to write what wet rainy where is rainy here rainy this one so here wet rainy wet rainy and here dry sunny this one you know it yes you know it as windy windy or stormy the same meaning stormy stormy windy stormy windy so we will write what here stormy windy and here is there any windy here any storm here no so this is called what calm calm what is the meaning of calm quiet there is no wind there is no storm so the weather will be what calm calm Okay, here we have what? Can you see the sky here and the sky here? The sky here is full of what? Clouds. So this weather is will be what? Cloudy. 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 And the weather here will be what? The sky here is what? Clear. Clear. What is the meaning of clear? There is no more clouds. Clear. No more clouds. No more clouds like this. Okay, so this page... Here we have the seasons and you know it. This is what? Spring, summer, fall. And here we have winter. The weather is here. Hot, cold, dry, sunny, wet, rainy, windy, stormy, calm, clear, cloudy. Okay, now we want to know the weather in hot and dry countries. The weather in hot and dry countries will be what? In summer season, it can be what during the day? Very hot, very hot during the day. And cool at night, cool. Not very cold, not very hot. It will be what? Cool, good weather. So in summer, it can be very hot during the day and cool at night. But in the winter, in the winter, it can be what during the day? It can be what? Warm, warm, 
not hot, not cold, not very cold, okay? So here in the winter, it can be what? Warm during the day and very, very cold at night. Very cold at night. The only time it rains only in the winter. So we can see rains only in the winter in hot and dry countries. We can see rains in hot and dry countries in the winter season. So what will we write here? So it rains only in the winter. There is no winter here. This will be winter, sorry. This one will be winter. So here we can see the rains in the winter. Again, the weather in hot and the dry countries is in summer. It can be what? Very hot during the day and cool at night. In the winter, it can be warm. In the day, warm means what? Not hot, not cold. And very cold at night. The only time it rains only when? In the winter. Okay, girls? Thank you, grade 2. If you can't understand any point, please send me a message. Bye-bye.